Okay, friends, so I want to talk about tools again. I'm going to talk about tools on how to get the transmission bolts off the top of the Jeep uh, 4.0 engine to transmission. So this is specifically about tools. So you need some external Torx sockets. And I bought some Duratec ones off of Amazon. So let me pull these out and let's have a look at them together. These were about $14, which was about half of anything I could buy locally. And they look like nice um, impact rated sockets. We need E14, which is a 3 8 And that's what's gonna go on the back of the transmission. But you also need a, so a universal joint. And I recommend a full swivel universal joint like this. I got a set of quarter, three eighths, and half inch for $20 on Amazon. The links will go in the description of the video. And that's not all, because it's 36 inches from the back of the tr transfer case to these bolts. So you also need some really long <laughs> extension rods to throw on the floor. Um, but this is, this is the secret weapon. So there's a 24, an 18, and a 12 that come in a set for $19.99 on Amazon. I'll put the link in the video description, but this is how we're gonna get to the bolts on the back of the transmission. This is a whole lot easier than reaching up over it, trying to reach around the back of the engine. Yeah, this is the ticket. So, watch my other videos on Jeep Re Rescue to figure out how I do it. Now, I'm gonna use it with a 3.8, 20 volt max cordless impact driver. This should be more than enough for an E14. So that's gonna be my next video. And again, I'll put links to the tools I'm using for this in the description. So if you don't wanna to have to search for them, you can just use those links. I do get a small commission from Amazon. It does not change the price you pay. They just pay me a referral fee and I really do appreciate your support of my channel. Remember to like my video, subscribe to the channel and turn on those alerts so you can find out when I release a new video and check out my playlist because that's how I organize the different topics I do videos about. And let me know what you think in the comments. Tell me what worked for you and what didn't work. Have a great one.